you may want to add your private email account to another email client, like Gmail. This might be for convenience, like the ability to see your business emails alongside your regular ones. You can also use it to send and receive emails from your business email address. Today, we will show you how to configure Gmail Fetcher for your private email account. So, let's start. First of all, log in to your Gmail account and go to Settings. Click the See All Settings button. Navigate to the e Accounts and Import tab and click Add Mail Account. Here you should enter the full private email address you want to add, then click Next. After this, select the Import Emails from My Other Account POP3 option and click Next. You'll see settings for the incoming server. Use your full private email address as the username and enter your private email password. The POP server should be set to mail.privateemail.com. Change the port to 995. This is used for SSL, which means your connection will be secured for receiving messages. Alternatively, it is possible to use port 110 without enabling SSL. To leave the copy of the emails on your server, you should mark the first option. If you want to have your private email account as a separate folder, mark the third option as well. Once all the details are entered, click the Add Account button. Now you can retrieve emails from this account. If you also want to send emails using your private email address, you'll need to configure the outgoing server as well. For this, tick the corresponding option and click Next. Here you can change the name that will be shown on emails you send. Click Next Step. Enter the outgoing server details. Use mail.privateemail.com as the SMTP server. As before, the username is your full private email address, and the password is the one you use for your private email account. Use port 465 with SSL enabled. Alternatively, you can use port 587 with TLS. Transport Layer Security, or TLS, is the upgraded version of SSL. It helps fix existing SSL vulnerabilities. A notification about a confirmation email will appear. Log in to your private email account via the private email webmail and click on the link in the confirmation email. That's it. Now you can check and send emails via the Gmail interface. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, you can post them under this video. Or check out our knowledge base at namecheap.com for more tips and support.